Hey everybody, today we are finally going to get out there and we're going to finish this banister on this stairway. Uh, that's probably all I'm going to do. I'm out of cedar. I mean, big pieces that I can use to do anything else with. So I'm going to have to find a place to get some more cedar. I need wide pieces by a half inch thick. So I'm going to probably have to hit a sawmill up uh, or rob it from somewhere in the house. Uh, I wanted to wish everybody a happy new year. This will be my last video of the year, obviously, unless I pull one off between now and tonight, which I doubt. And uh, so what you're going to see in this video is I'm going to be cutting slats, or, um, vertical slats, to go in the panels. Uh, I was thinking about maybe going kind of angled horizontal. Um, I don't think it would have got a good look out of that. Uh, I think you'll you'll like how they come out because I've already done it. I'm putting this in the front of the video. They 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 came out much better than expected. Uh, you'll just see. And I want to ask everybody if if you're not if you haven't subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button. Give me a like. Uh, appreciate you know all my subscribers. If you may leave a comment, I always read them. And if whenever I hit, whenever you see that I've liked your comment, that means I've read it. And I ain't got so big yet that I can't read everybody's comments. Uh, I may not answer every one of them. Where's this camera? There it is. I may not be able to answer them all. Uh, but if it, you know, if I, if I, if it deserves an answer, or really needs an answer, I'll give it an answer. So, but uh, I appreciate everybody that's helped me. I started my YouTube basically the end of August. And, you know, it's went well. So I hope to 2022 is a much better year. I, I, I'm going to have all kinds of content for you. Uh, sorry for kicking the floor there. But, and also, you know, check out my other channel. It's called Doggone It. And if you look down in the description, there'll be a link to that. That channel's a little different. It's mostly, you know, content that I wouldn't put on a homestead channel. And I do put on, like, my coffees twice a week on this channel. Some people enjoy them, some don't. Uh, but you always have the option to not watch them, you know. If, if, if you know that that's kind of content you don't like, well, you don't, have to, you don't have to watch them, you know. But it's there if you do. And I appreciate everybody. Have a good year and enjoy the video. What I'm doing here, uh, I need to establish this angle. So I'm setting the board right here. I drew me a line right there and I had my level on it, make sure it's level. What I'm going to do is I'm going to put these rough cut cedar like we've got all around the rest of the place inside here, slats going vertical. And then around here, there'll be a, a frame and it'll be flush with this. So you'll see when I'm done what I'm doing here. Uh, this will not get the linseed oil, so it'll just remain. It'll kind of, it's going to look good because it's going to have both the, the linseed oil part that's a darker color and the rough cut, which will match the rest of the, of the cabin. So let me get started. All right, I got the first one nailed in place. The first one's very important to make sure that it is exactly level or you're going to be out with a gap somewhere in here we've got a little room for play because i'm going to frame this in the, to bring flush with this and that will look good when it's done i'm trying to pick some some of these pieces with some character in it like knot holes uh things like that but i'm very limited on what i have right now so <laughs> we're not going to get too picky <laughs>
All right, I got the first one framed in. Uh, 8,000 trips later, in and out, cutting. <laughs> I think it looks all right. Uh, beats having open panels like that one. Now we're gonna get on that one. So, and I made sure there was some gaps in there so you could see through it a little bit, you know, kind of give it that barn look. Uh, and then you could see, got screw, oh, this is wood from Jeff's porch, so it's got the old screw holes. I, I wanted that in there. That looks cool, I think. And, uh, yeah, we're using up the scrap. It doesn't, the shadows are making it look uneven here, but it's, it's straight. So, hey man, when the lights are turned out, you ain't gonna notice anything that's off anyway. And if I look at something long enough and it bugs me, I'll fix it. All right, let me get to working on this dude right here. Be back. Okay, we've got the banister done. I think I like it. It's a little bit wider up here, but you really can't tell. Ain't nobody. The measurement police ain't coming over. At least I hope not. They might now. Uh, only thing I want to do this this rebar was crooked. It, I need to re-drill down here at the bottom and move it out a little bit because that drives me nuts. It's off. And then I'll patch in the rest of the hole. That's an easy fix. Then we'll come around and kind of fill in some of these old nail holes. Uh, we won't, I ain't gonna get to that today. That'll be what I'm gonna start on now that we've done that. Um, and I, my tripod's busy outside right now, or my selfie stick, so. I only have one sheet of my uh, cedar left, so I'm gonna try to get as much of this done. I do have scraps, so <laughs> I may have to rob a piece from somewhere in the house that ain't noticeable. I got places I could do that. All right, let me eat some sandwiches and get back to work. And just a couple of grilled ham and cheese sandwiches for lunch. Taking a little break. Look at them. Look at them bad boys. Uh, grilled ham and cheese that's good and I'm gonna wash it down by swigging the milk dark, uh, directly out of the daggum jug all right let me eat this down and we'll get back to work here it's lunch time guys All right, I went ahead and put a coat of linseed oil on all of them, and I like it. It looks so much better. Uh, I was wanting to leave that natural, like that color there, but with the dark rail and everything, it just, it looks better that way. Put another coat on the railing, on everything, and it looks better. Still don't like this, but... You know, it's, when you ain't got the light shining on it, you can't really tell. It blends in with everything else, so. But, uh, yeah. And I screwed up up here. I'm glad it's on the inside. That's some of Jeff's old wood. Let me zoom in. <laughs> I didn't even cut that old stuff off, that one. So, I may have to get up here with some sandpaper. Eh, you ain't gonna see it. All right, guys, that's going to wrap it up for this. I went to start on that. I am going to have to pull some cedar off somewhere. It ain't going to happen today, but this is all mostly about the banister, and we got the banister done. So, hope you all enjoyed the build. Happy trails.